now, 39 years of age. So I've had a fair few experiences of Christmases, both as a adult and, and as a child. And there's been some really fun memories um, over, over the years. One of them in particular that I remember really vividly was actually just last year. I've got a couple of colleagues who occasionally I go out for uh, a lunch with and um, we hadn't met up for quite some time and we tried to organise one and eventually, like right at the early part of December, we thought, do you know what, let's try and get um, a, a chance to, to, to meet up. It's Christmas, a chance to just gather our thoughts and see how the year's been. So we got together, we went to the Red Lion, which is a pub just across the road, and we went upstairs to our usual, which is our normal fish and chip uh, place for lunch. And uh, we were unfortunate enough to find that there was a big Christmas party going on, which is, you know, it's a real shame. And we thought, OK, fair enough. How about the Railway Tavern? Do you know what? It does a good pie and chip. So up we went, trotted up. Sorry, lads, we're closed. We've got another Christmas party. And we thought, this is not going too well. So anyway, lo and behold, we thought, do we just give it a miss and maybe plan something after Christmas? Nah, let's give it another shot. One last go. So we trotted off again. A few minutes later, we caught ourselves a pub on the right on the corner, just a, um, a few more minutes away from work. Up the steps we went and we thought, surely this can't happen. Surely this can't happen. So we got in. We've got a table for three, three guys, please. <laughs> He's madam. Yeah, sure. So we walked into the pub and we sat down. Gosh, this is almost playing out like the Christmas story. Anyway, so we settled, sat her down, we got our menus and a waitress came and she leans over and we all three of us turn our heads at the last minute. Could not believe it. Eight months pregnant. I mean, you couldn't write this stuff, could you? We were lit in fits of laughter. And that was one of my stories about Christmas. Um, and Christmas for me is about fun. It's about enjoyment. It's about spending time with fat family and, and, and having a really good time. What is Christmas about? And what is this time of Advent about for me? Well, it's a time of preparation. If we, I find it really bizarre that as a nation, we've gone through a period of celebrating death and darkness to suddenly shouting out about fireworks. And then all of a sudden we're there celebrating the birth of the Lord Jesus Christ. And that all happens so, so quickly from one to another. I guess sometimes I, I think about Christmas a bit like a candle versus a firework. A firework, we all get there, don't we? And we all look at a firework and we're so, all that anticipation, the excitement, and we see it go up and within seconds, that firework, that light has just disappeared. A candle, it's different, isn't it? A candle just it sits there and it, it lights up a place, it lights up a room and it lasts much longer than a firework. And you use a candle to light other candles, don't you? We talk about the um, Advent being a time when we wait for the birth of Jesus Christ and the light of the world. And that's my story to, today, is to talk to everyone and to share my feelings about what God and this time of Advent means to me. It's about the birth of the Lord Jesus Christ coming into this world.